I had a patient with plantar plate injury, one of the toughest conditions. He saw three podiatrists and they all told him that he needed surgery. So what I did was that I provided IV infusion. He was able to reach complete 100% recovery because within two and a half months, he was able to run a Ironman. It was a beautiful result. Hi, this is Dr. Joy Kong again. I've been getting different questions. And one of the questions is that, can you guarantee results with your stem cell therapy? So first of all, I think a person would be hard pressed to find any doctor who's going to guarantee results for any condition. So each person is so complex, even medication that has gone through tremendous studies. Still, there's a success rate, right? It's never a hundred percent. So no, no doctor will be able to guarantee results. But that said, we can give you percentages of chances of success of uh, probabilities. So looking at research, looking at past experiences, that's when doctors can come up with a probability. So for stem cell therapy, depending on what kind of condition you're trying to get help for, there are different probabilities. Some conditions, there are more evidence and there's more experience from the doctors such as autoimmune conditions or muscular skeletal repair. Those have a lot more clinical data. So a doctor can be a little more confident about whether or not you are going to see some kind of result. And even that, it may not be a hundred percent, right? So there could be results, could be improvements, but it may not be a hundred percent. But by doing another treatment or doing a series, you may reach better and better results. So it may be incremental. So for musculoskeletal repair, I, you know, I can only speak from my clinical experience, not for every doctor because every doctor treats uh, patients differently. I use certain combination of modalities, including ozone therapy, different supplements, different peptides and stem cells. So it's a combination and red light, not just red light, but other frequencies, other colors of light that's uh, very powerful in activating and directing the cells. So as a combination, I can tell you what kind of success rate I have seen in my clinic. For muscular skeletal repair, I would say 90% of patients will see some kind of improvements. Some will see more drastic improvements. They may feel completely fine. They will say, this is incredible. I am uh, fully recovered. For example, I had a patient with plantar plate injury, one of the toughest conditions. He's a podiatrist. That he saw three podiatrists and they all told him that he needed surgery. And he was very hesitant to get surgery because he's an avid triathlete. And he really was concerned about what will happen if the surgery it's, may change the shape of his foot. And also the recovery time is so long. So he wanted to avoid that if, if it's possible. So what I did was that I provided an IV infusion, which helps your immune system on board, right? They bring them, activate them so the cells can come into a local area to promote repair and regeneration. And then we use a uh, therapeutic ultrasound machine to help activate the local tissue and direct more cells there. So nowadays I'm uh, using laser, but there are different modalities you can combine. So without injecting into his foot, just by putting the cells into the IV and the cells will be attracted to the local injury and then using a device to attract more cells into the area in combination with the supplements and peptides he was able to reach complete 100% recovery because within two and a half months, he was able to run a Ironman. So he was a competing Ironman. So it was a beautiful result, right? So it can happen that way. It can, it can be that drastic, but it may be partial improvement. For some people, it may be only, let's say 50% or 90% improvement. So everyone is a little different and depends on how severe the injury may be, right? How much tear there is. Do you need more sessions to help to build the tissue? How much inflammation is in the body? How much your body's able to work with the cells to promote regeneration? If you're older, then it's going to be a little bit more sluggish. If you have a certain chronic illnesses, 
all that is going to drain your body's ability to help you repair. So you need to look at all these different factors. And that's what we address in the clinic is to look at what may be preventing you from healing in the first place, right? Why did you get sick? And why are you not healing? So we're giving you the different tools to help your body to get to a more optimal state. For one thing, that there's no guarantee of results. And the other thing is that sometimes patients may come in with an idea of helping with one thing. Let's say I have stomach issues and I, I want stem cells to help me with that. But that particular thing, you may not notice enough benefit from that one thing, but doesn't mean the cells are not going all around your body, promoting repair in all these other tissues because it's not infrequent, it actually happens quite a bit. Because we do a review of system, we look at all the things that's going on in the body, what patients have been having difficulties with, having issues with in, in all these different areas of their health, including their mood, their energy level, their sleep, even allergy symptoms and aches and pains, different things. So we track them. So a lot of times when we go back a month or two after the treatment, we ask the patient, are you still experiencing this? What about this? What about this? And the patient would be like, no, I don't have that. I don't have that. But when you ask them, do you think stem cells have helped you? Is that no, I don't think so. Because whatever they were focusing on, that one thing may not have improved uh, to the point that they can see. And so they think stem cell therapy doesn't work. But when you actually look at what's happening in the body, is promoting a lot of repair. And also, if you look at the anti-aging benefits, which I love because I've been doing this every three months for the last eight years, you know, I'm a scientific experiment for everybody. You know, I can see the rejuvenation, the dialing back of the clock, getting younger and younger and on so many levels. So it's not just, you know, me as a single, you know, statistic. It, it's really... I'm deriving this conclusion from scientific studies, from clinical studies or animal studies, looking at lifespan and health span and looking at the markers of aging, which are a lot of inflammation markers and senescent markers, toxic waste buildup and DNA changes. Everything after regular stem cell treatments can be reverted. So even one treatment can help reverse a lot of these aging process. So Let's say you come in for whatever, headache, and that has not improved to your satisfaction. It doesn't mean that you have not de-aged, that you have not gained rejuvenation and helped you live longer and live better. So just keep that in mind, you know, when we're looking at, should I be satisfied or should I be disappointed? And keep that overall framework in mind, and that will be a more fair way of looking at stem cell therapy because one, your body's complex. Two, the cells could be doing all kinds of things for your body that you may not be focusing on, but it doesn't mean that it has not worked. So that's my input for this particular question. You know, can you promise stem cells are going to help you? I'm pretty sure it can help you to some extent, if not a lot, which is why stem cell therapy is so popular because it helped so many people. And that's what I see why I say this is a grassroots movement, because it actually are helping, helping in cases where there's little help from conventional medical treatments. So I'm educated from, you know, conventional medical school and, and the whole residency training. So I know what we have to offer and I know how ineffective and disappointing and disheartening it is for a doctor who came in, at least I did, or most doctors I know came in to be a healer, to be helpful. So if you are learning all this knowledge, and you ended up not being able to help is not a pleasant way to live your life, you know, to feel that you are being helpful in this world. So this is why I'm so excited about stem cells. That's why I'm so excited to share with other providers, so we can all benefit. So we elevate the human health and human happiness together. So that's all I have for you today. Thank you for listening to me and let's do this together. 